the Black Mage, one of the most iconic roles in Final Fantasy. However, within Final Fantasy XIV, they are one of the most hated jobs out there, thanks to their extremely difficult skill rotation and playstyle. Within PvP, Black Mages are one of the most feared and respected jobs around, bringing some extremely powerful damage to the battlefield. So do you have a pent-up urge for murder and mayhem? Then stay tuned, as today's video is my advanced guide to the Black Mage in PvP. Welcome back to the channel, my name's Salamander, and I shall be your guide. For the comparison, we have three jobs which fit into the magical range category, the first of which being the Summoner. Bringing moderate damage to the battle, they also come equipped with the largest ground-based AoE, this alongside their ability to bind and heavy targets at range, on top of a very powerful ultimate which has two variants, one for strong damage and the other for strong party healing, has made the Summoner a strong and reliable choice for frontline, while seeing a less pick rate within Crystalline Conflict due to there being better picks and a struggle to new players to learn, since misplaying within the competitive scene often means a free kill for the opposing team. And up next we have the Red Mage. Seeing a lot of play in those first few months after the 6.1 rework, the Red Mage is the only casting job that comes with stances, the Black Shift and the White Shift. The shifts firstly grant access to two specific skills, alongside applying additional abilities to the main rotation. These additionals either apply bonus damage over time or grants barriers to the Red Mage. They also come equipped with a long-range CC ability, either Bind or a very powerful Silence depending on the current stance. The Red Mage is the only casting job which can dash to a target and switch up to a melee playstyle. This makes them fantastic for finishing weak targets, and can change their playstyle with great ease to suit the situation. So what makes the Black Mage unique? To begin, in terms of raw damage, they best Red Mages and Summoners by far, and if you are looking for a casting role which devastates in both Frontline and Crystalline, the Black Mage will not steer you wrong. While Summoners have access to two CC effects, the Black Mage comes equipped with four. You have a Mass Sleep, which I firmly believe is the strongest CC skill out there, as this force is entire groups to either take the sleep or give up their purify early. They also have a bind, heavy, and deep freeze within their blizzard rotation. This means that with every battle, a black mage can look for strong crowd control opportunities. From a safe distance, you can output extremely powerful single and multi-target damage fire and ice spells. And as previously mentioned, your ice abilities can apply CC, while your fire can apply damage over time. Should a black mage get into a pinch, you have the option to either dash to an enemy or a party member. This will also grant you swift cast, perfect for the burst ability, dealing insane amounts of damage around you while granting you a shield, and if that is not enough to convince you to pick up the Black Mage, the ultimate is a DPS player's wet dream, granting you access to foul and six stacks of soul resonance, allowing you to run around instantly casting flares and freeze into huge groups of players. All of this have allowed the Black Mage to become the dominant casting pick, if played well. For your main rotation, you have two options, fire or ice. How you decide will depend on your situation. If you're looking for high damage combined with damage over time into groups, fire is your best friend. However, if you are looking to use heavy, bind and deep freeze, ice will be your rotation of choice. For the base damage, fire and ice spells are identical. The fire rotation consists of fire, fire 4 and flare, while the ice rotation starts with blizzard into blizzard 4 ending with freeze. Each time you land a fire spell, the target gets one stack of astral warmth, while ice will add a stack of umbral freeze. Both stacks can reach a maximum count of three. You cannot, however, hold stacks of both. For example, if you had two stacks of warmth and then cast blizzard, you will be reset to one stack of umbral freeze. These stacks by themselves mean nothing. They are to be combined with the action Super Flare. If you are using the Fire Rotation, using Super Flare will deal 3000 damage per stack up to 9000, and at the same time applies burn damage over time, up to a maximum of 12 seconds depending on how many stacks you had. This is really powerful into large groups of enemies. Being able to cast large scale AoEs plus damage over time really helps to shut down aggressive pushes, even when the enemy team has a player advantage. Now if you're in the Ice Rotation, not only do you deal the same damage per stack, you will also deal one of three CC effects. At one stack, your target will be heavied. At two stacks, they will be inflicted with bind. And should your target have a full three stacks, the target is struck with deep freeze. Heavy is perfect for those fast moving targets and fleeing enemies, while bind is amazing to use against ultimates, such as the samurai, shutting them down before they can even utilize their ability. And deep freeze is all of the above, freezing the target solid in place. I myself have found this very powerful against teams that run a large number of tanks, shutting down their abilities and any means of escape. 
If you're in need of a full free stacks, you'll be looking to use the action called Paradox. As long as you have at least one warmth or one free stack, Paradox will instantly boost you to free stacks. I personally love using this ability on outer position targets and tanks. Strike them with a single blizzard, into Paradox, into Super Flare for the deep freeze effect. Next we have Ethereal Manipulation, allowing you to dash to either an enemy or a party member. You always want to combine this with the burst ability, dealing a large 16,000 damage around you. This will also grant you personal shielding. You can do this combo aggressively in attempts to hide damage or to secure a kill, but comes at a higher risk. Or use this defensively, should you or a team member get dove, dash in, pop a burst for that instant damage and shield, oftentimes this can be enough to scare the target away. The next ability is your Nightwing, your mass sleep ability. This is a S tier CC effect. Your target and all nearby are struck with half a sleep. They must then decide to either take the sleep after 3 seconds, in which the first attack that lands while sleeping will deal bonus damage, or give up their purify early, leaving them defenseless to your team. And last we have the ultimate, Soul Resonance. To kick it off, this unlocks Foul, a one-time use, instant cast 16,000 damage. You can hold on to this action for one minute, allowing you to wait for the opportune moment to strike. You are also granted six stacks of Soul Resonance. This allows you to instantly cast Flare and Freeze with no cast time. One stack is consumed with every cast. This ultimate allows you to output insane damage. Adding Super Flare into the mix will allow you to incinerate entire teams that are grouped up. Amazing for use against tank spam, as the high damage, burns and freezing will quickly force them of all their resources, not to mention the Limit Break charges insanely fast allowing you to use at the moment you obtain, as it is very yeah, likely you will have a second ultimate around. by the time most players obtain their first. To kick it off, you are almost unrivaled in the sheer amount of AoE damage you can deal, compared to the other casters and many other roles. You can also hold your own very well in 1v1 situations. You have some fairly decent movement in which you can hold two charges. This movement allows you to engage, flee, and even jump to the aid of a party member in trouble, following up with a strong AoE blast and a strong personal shield. You also have the most CC effects of any job, allowing you to punish players in every fight. A Black Mage's limit gauge charges extremely fast. There is no wrong way to use this ultimate. Burn one or two targets or go crazy blasting into crowds. It is all raw damage which will greatly help turn fights, and you will very likely have a second ultimate before most players reach their first. To top it off, the Black Mage overall is not too difficult, perfect for first timers to pick up. With so many strengths, it comes to no surprise that if you pick up Black Mage in PvP, many times, especially within Crystalline, you will find yourself hard focused, which can make learning the job harder if you struggle under pressure. With so much power, it becomes very easy to overextend. Black Mages caught out in the open will drop very quickly, if multiple targets jump your way. Fast burst damage classes such as the Dragoons and the Monks can catch you off guard very quickly if you lose focus. Your movement at times can be a struggle. If your team go out of range, you lose your means of dashing out to a safe distance. And don't underestimate other long range jobs, such as machinists and dancers, with their power and movement can make your life a struggle. This is everything you need to know for picking up the Black Mage in PvP. Keep good positioning and follow your team up with aggressive plays. I wish you all the best at bringing pure chaos to PvP. Thanks for clicking on today's video. If you wish to see more advanced PvP guides, consider checking out my other content. Thanks again, and I shall see you all in the next one. Do you get damage? I'm back enough. Well, not that nice. Just leave. But yeah, we need to get top right. I'm alright. Go back to the keep. Wow, this like terrible. Yeah, I don't know why I'm so much all of us are done. You didn't see that. I wasn't walking into a wall. <laughs> I may have caught that on the side of my screen. So a lot of them above us here. I've been limited by a Sleeping him. Um, like gunbreaker. On him as well. Right, God. Hit him with burn. I'm gonna need the gunbreak in, in group. In the bar at the back. Gunbreak just popped his ult. Yeah, just stunned him. Ah, oh, missed. That range. On the one I'll front. I'll stun the Oh, nice. I'm, I'm with you. Okay, I'm with you. I'm going down. I'm going down. Bigger damage. I'm gonna hit the bar with half asleep and then one around him. Bar is pretty critical. I'm on the gun breaker and I'll back back. On him. 
I think he's out of there. Heals now, isn't he? Hit him with the flares. Beautiful. Dark Knights. Oh, huge damage. Dark Knight on the left. Again, again. Yes. I made it a hell damage. That, that, that was loud damage. Indeed. Warrior, warrior, warrior. On him. Cool knockout though. Hitting that summoner. He's also half asleep. Weak. Going for that second bard. Half choppy. Bard is one. Yeah, start that too. Ooh, got that one. This is very good, very good. On that power, then on our back. Oh, bard switching to it. Back right, back right. Thank you for coming. Hey, are you? I'm bringing him some fire. He likes fire, right? Maybe. I'm not going to break. Uh, if you got an option, go for it. They are retreating, though. Got Blind Mage is half slipped, half slipped. He's in with the freeze. Binding them. Five some. Big damage. This little bugger turned me into an imp. Ooh. Oh, I guess we should go for the points. Go on, go on, go. Okay, good. Yeah, north. Good push though, I'm on 36. I'm 18. We'll get these battle highs oh. and we'll flip this game. Yeah. You safe, Benny? Yeah. I was making sure your ass got out. My ass, 36 battle highs. Dark Knight, I'm playing the Dark Asleep. It's done the Dark Knight. Oh, a glimmer break. Oh. Can't go freezing now. I've been sunned. On that monk. I'm getting the press. monk with limit break. <laughs> Do it. I got pulled on your ink, the bin CC. Big flaring. Fuck him out of heels. Half asleep on that dot, right? I am hop and chalky. My game just minimized mid combat, that's not good. I'm much clear alive. There's going to be gaps in here. Yeah. What's it? Pop tool. I'll go freezing for you. Oh, Since he breaks guard. There's a, a gun break behind. That's a nice froze. He's also burning, half asleep. Zap. Still there. Critical. Oh, he's out, he's out, he's out. There's too many. I can freeze him again. As long as we can get the point now that the teammate following up there. Sorry, I'm just there. Yeah, got him, got him. <laughs> nice. Hello, monk sir. Are you trying to push me in? Oh, push me away. That helps, that helps. He just ordered uh, me at full health. I'm just going to walk away now. I'm going to wait. I'm going to be the bigger person you know, and Walk away. <laughs> walk yeah, I'm away. Gonna, I'm going to break him. You dead. Oh, someone, someone, someone. And that Darnite gonna hit him with Deep Freeze. Stunning him now. I think Yellow pushing them. Oh, we need to go to the beach. Next Come point. On. Fall back, Benny. Uh, am I on the way? Yeah. I've got a limb break again. Yeah, we can't really push Kev, can we? But these two spots are better. Almost at the next limit break. Oh, oh. oh that, dark knight, that dark knight has just... Oh, we're not going to deep freeze him. And him with half sleep. Still in that gunbreaker. Oh, and gunbreaker also. Hit him now. Found him. He's a free kill. Yeah, he is. Shwink. Oh, another gunbreaker. He's pretty cool. Oh, we got him. It's a poor little bugger. Dragon on the right. The Dark Knight is pushing him down there. He's holding the Dragon, that's, that's the Dragon. A limit break. Hit him with half sleep. Dark Knight, I'm gonna freeze. Just in now. AIE, deep freeze. Beautiful, on that warrior. What's the next limit break? They got a lot of tanks, I've just noticed. Hmm. Yeah, they do. It's not oh, working out, but they're not really killing us. They don't have damage for it, but looks like. Heavy nip. Mm -hmm. 
That's all that question. next done there. I'm gonna dive in my limb break. Okay, go. Okay, go. Okay, go. Okay, go. Okay, go. Okay, go. Deep freezing him now. And half sleeping him. Beautiful. Five knockout door. On the bad. I'll just say bad, bad, bad. I see him. Actually, I'm gonna set the machines quickly. Hitting them big. Six knockout door. Right behind you, cynical. I'm gonna you white mage. It's done. I was cut point blanks by the way. white mage. <laughs> cool, um. nice. And then we flare. Bard's coming back. Mm, Bard's going back to spawn. Put two dragoons. <laughs> Are we leaving? Let's get this pad in a minute. Come break on, man. I want that dragoon on the side. Yeah, come here. I want to deep freeze him. Come with deep freeze. Going for the machines. Hit points. Hit points. I'm wet. Yeah, we're on fuck all points, I don't understand. Oh, so we got, uh, yeah, we got a few dying army too much. I'm at night 4 though. The entire Ooh. red team's here. Almost there. Oh, they got a look at force ones in there. Half asleep on that monk. No, 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 no. Deep freezing, deep freezing. Up in lemon break. Somewhere on point. On it. Found it. And again. Go for that Ninin. Switching uh, summoner. One summoner. Also dead. Now Ninin. Go for that one in cave. Bro, they spawned to so unfair. Because look where the next two are. And now we're going to have to fight yellow for them again. As if. <laughs> Which is like, make fucking yellow fight the red team. No, game's like, no, not today. We are winning third place. What's your bet in that kid's got no score? Honestly, 9%. <laughs> it's usually the way when they're talking chat, isn't it? Okay, yellow are now fighting them as well. Dragon, I've just half slept. Going for that warrior. I'm on my money. Deep freezing him. Hey, no cutter. Funny. Would that be so cool? Oh, 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 oh. Nice. Red's up north. I'm gonna go help with that. Oh, I'm going with. So I've got some fat damage right now with 100 battle high. Got a limit break that could back you up. Oh, I can deep freeze him for you. Please. Let's get my active. Okay. That. That Dive that red mage. Red mage, you say? We'll, you we'll win this fight up top because yellow are fighting red to the south for some reason. Still on the red mage yet? Uh, I think I'm on scholar. Half slip this in. Yes. Boys. We can flip this. the first time this game. Uh, we should go mid. Yeah, that's a good Let call. everyone mid now. We're not actually at a mid yet, have we? Because we could also just collapse in the entire red team. Hmm. It is tempting. Uh, I don't... I think I can make that. I'm gonna come with you. Hello, baby. Hello, hello. Hello, baby. Oh, oh, no. <laughs> hey, rank down there. That's good. I kind of want to stay mid for a minute, though. I see you looking like my own. Oh, no. That's 50%. Oh, we got, we, we got it. Hmm? We got, we got the staff one. Let's give it a minute. There's two more I might spawn in a second. I got thin up the ramps oh, on this one as well. Shit, I thought there was a yellow next to that sheep amount, but. Reds are struggling a bit. I think they're trying to just farm yellows for their free win. Yep, record it. Oh, mid, mid, mid. I got it, got it. Double just in case anyone tries to interrupt. Okay, no, some red. Yeah, reds have noticed. And north. Oh, fuck. We gotta get cave. There's a guy in his car. I'm gonna try and sleep in a second. It's a summoner. I'm close to limit break. Mm, really good, really good. He has I'm no idea we're here. I've slept him. Dip. Good day, sir. Here comes the team. Back up. Fight. Back up. That is a lot of food. Yeah, it is. Prison that samurai. Steep froze. 
On the point we're using to go. Let's try and stall it. I've been down, but I can let me break the stall. Let me some burn. That's them, right? <laughs> this Reaper wants my ass so bad. Oh, we can't surround it. Yeah, it comes the rest of them. There it is, that's good. Where's that team at? Yeah, I'm in cave now. Ah, they're busy with yellow. Oh, come on, let's check a battle fight. Disengage yellow, fight red. Can you take his own advice? We're the only three here. <laughs> Not bad, I went 9, 126, 1.4 million.